with my van life. And this is my van, and this is Sunday morning. And this is what I wake up to every morning, <clears throat> Live, uh, living here underneath. Uh, you can't really tell right here, but I'm in a barn. Uh, I'm staying currently with my elderly mother and her husband. Uh, he is approaching 90 and she is approaching 80. So I help them out by being here and they help me out by letting me stay here. And plus, I, you know, I contribute in many ways with yard work. This is a huge yard. And I help out around the house and et cetera, et cetera. So anyway, uh, this is a 2018 Ford Transit Connect. When I first put this cork tile up, I didn't realize that the adhesion that comes with it is pathetic until I put the rest of it up. And I learned that uh, because I already had spray foam for my ribs, <coughs> It just dawned on me that it'd be a good idea to use spray foam to adhere the cork. And that's what I did on the rest of it, and it worked beautifully. Solid as a rock. So that's what I've got to do here. I'm going to fix that. And I'm going to fix some imperfections over here. Just kind of clean it up a little bit. And I'm going to redo these lights the string light, the fairy lights, whatever they're called. Redo them a little bit, make it look a little bit neater. And I've got a ton of projects that I'm going to be doing on this van, so I might as well document it. I'm going to be putting a shelf down here for these speakers so that I have more room on the counter top. And <clears throat> that's my heater that I got last year. It works really, really great. I've got shore power, so I don't have to worry about the amount of power that it takes currently. Uh, when I do get on the road, I will no longer be using electric heat. I'll be using, I've already got the Olympic Wave 3, and I've used it, and it's more than adequate. And since I'm going to be out west, I don't have to worry about moisture too awfully much, I don't think. <clears throat> I'd like to redo this door. It's really ugly. I've got this double adhesive tape on here to keep my cat from scratching it and he, because he pretty much tore it, tore it up. But uh, I'd like to put some cedar veneer on here or something, vinyl, something that he won't be able to destroy. And there's a lot of things I'm going to be doing outside as well. Normally, I have a 5,000 BTU air conditioner in that window right there during the summer. It's not there now, obviously, because it's, you know, it's fall, it's cooler, I don't need it. But my plan is to put that air conditioner right here in the back window. And then put my Max Air fan in this window. I hate to give up my, my uh, view of the outdoors, but I'm going to have cameras, so... If I need to see out, I'll just use my cameras. <clears throat> what do I do for a living? I work from home. I uh, do marketing research. So it's kind of like customer service. Um, so yeah, I don't have to drive anywhere, so that's really nice. And I work 25 hours a week, and that's more than enough for me. That gives me time to do other things like help out with my mom, help my mom and her husband out with yard work, housework, etc. And I uh, woke up this morning to a herd of deer, literally a herd, and that's pretty typical around here. There's a lake back there. I'll, uh, some other time I'll show you around a little bit, but I just wanted to make a quick introductory video and uh, just want to welcome everyone to to join me on my journey I'm not sure how long I'm going to be here but uh, 
as long as they're physically able and uh, everything like that. I'll be here to save money and eventually retire and move out west and travel. But in the meantime, I'm not going to be traveling too much. Just so you know. But you're welcome to subscribe and like if you want. And join me next time. Bye-bye.